sorry. Nana Morpho's here to bake some cookies for Christmas. Oh, let's lay down some presents. Have you been a good or naughty boy slash and or girl this Christmas? May you be with family and friends. Alright, so, we have a bunch of different Pokemon themed presents here. Some of them are from the Christmas 2019 Limited Edition Pokemon Center collection. Some of the stuff is just random things, like, look at this! Santa got me this Pokemon Generations box! That's something we'll open on the channel at another point. What else do we have in here? We have Pikachu from, it's, that's from two Christmases ago. Man, Santa sure is getting me some shitty gifts. That's actually because I bought a big mystery box and they sent me a bunch of stuff and I realized I buy so many things from Subble. Look, it's Subble. A very high quality Subble plushie. He's my starter, he's my main boy. We're gonna put him here. He can sit up, he's got too big of a head. Okay, good boy. Yeah, so I bought a mystery box and I just received things that I'd already got before. I didn't want to put it in any other video, so I just re-wrapped it for this shitty big Christmas special. All right, what do we have here? This is Electivire performing in some sort of band. He plays the drums. He has a little Rotom decal and a little Magnemite decal on his drum. And he's kind of wearing some weird trousers. And if you look on the tag, you'll see he's performing in a band with Pikachu and Zorora. This came out as part of a campaign called the Pokemon Band Festival. I'm not exactly sure if there was ever actually music performed or anything like that. But I do know that they had a very real Pikachu guitar. Electric guitar, I think, that was in super, super limited quality that also came out as part of that campaign. And I didn't manage to get my hands on one of those, but we will open up our next present, which, ah, yes, themed fittingly, a shirt related to the Pokemon Band Fest campaign. X Milk Fed. Again, I'm a little bit hazy on the details, but Milk Fed was originally, I think, I think an American clothing brand in the 90s and then at some point it changed hands to a Japanese company which still makes clothing. And interestingly this Pokemon milk fed collaboration has Los Angeles on it which I guess is to maybe pay respect to its roots or maybe they actually did a thing in Los Angeles. Maybe there was a Pokemon band performed thing. I don't know! But I am going to change into it. I am sweating to death. Next! What do we have? What does Santa have for me here? Ah, it's an actual Pokemon Christmas item. Pokemon Frosty Christmas. Uh, I'm not even sure what this is. It has some interesting artwork on it. I like the Sudo Wudo Minimalistic Christmas Tree. Let's find out what's inside. Candy? Of course. We've got red and blue, different kinds of candy, chocolate and white. All right, let's... Mmm! Oh! Oh, that's like a strawberry rice bubbles crackle sort of chocolatey thing going on there. What's this blue one about? Mmm! A chocolate version. Very average. I give it a 4 out of 10. Yeah. Egg! Alright! Let's open some more. We have a Pikachu shitty plushie from the Pokemon Let's Go campaign. We have up next... A little plushie of Executor, but he looks like Ditto. I mean, it's because it's Ditto, right? It's got a lot of leaves up here. Up next, we have... Ooh! Some Pokemon socks. This is from a more recent campaign. I'm not sure what the purpose was, but there is a fat Pikachu and a fat Meowth in a very weird style. Potentially an artist collaboration. 
They're going to sleep in this one. Next, we have a small version of Sobble. I'm calling it, I'm gonna get the world's biggest Sobble plushie collection. Mark my words. His head looks like it's been a little bit warped from the wrapping, but he's all good. Next, what do we have in this one? I think I know what this is. More garbage. Oh, that one's gone right in the landfill. Pokemon plastic plates from a very old set. By very old, I mean a, probably a couple of months. Pokemon Summer Collection. Various plates here. Uh, I think I've shown them before when I did my Summer Pokemon video, but that was another one that I got in the big mystery box. And now we have a Mimikyu. Or is it a Ditto? Very soft, squishy in this very light tones. I'm really going for the speed run now. I've realized I've got so many different gifts here to open. What is this? What is this? This is not an excuse for a Christmas item. Frosty Christmas, this is one of the most recent ones. You can take them off like so and stick them where you like. Next, what do we have on this one? Another Christmas, oh no, it's another fat Pikachu. Fat Meowth, and I think this one has a fat Raichu. It's so cute. That's gotta be a special collab artist, it has to be. Oh, inside we have a Scraggy. Scraggy and Pikachu! Next, we have Pika a Pikachu inflatable donut. This one, again, it's from the summer collection, I think. Come on, Pikachu, get in there. Yeah, you, you look so good in there. Next, what do we have in this one? Oh, yes! I wanted to open this one. Okay, so, the weird Meowth and Pikachu, look! They have a plushie. Isn't this adorable? He has no neck. Or he's all neck. I don't know. Next! What do we have on this one? A sun and moon collector chest for putting all your Pokemon cards. We've got Grookey, Squaw Bunny, and Sobble. And this opens up like so, and you can hide anything you like in there, kids. All right. Oh. Papa needs his og. His nog. Next! Do they ever stop? I don't know. Let's find out. We have... This has got to be candy. We've got Lavatar, Krogunk, Slowpoke, Pikachu, and Meowth here. And let's see what the tin looks... Oh! Jiyu Chikanchu! It's so cute! That That is a gorgeous tin as well. Not a whole lot of candy. It's just going to taste like plastic. But the tin is cool. Now, let us open up the next... Gift from Santa! So many from this set! I must be just opening them all in a clump. Another fat Pikachu and Meowth. And Pikachu is either not wanting to go to bed, or he's just woke up very, very upset and turned off his alarm clock. Oh, and on the back, Meowth is asleep and the alarm clock is going off and Pikachu is about to electrocute it. And that is a little zip out thingy, pencil case, but you could put pencils or whatever else you want in there, kids. Next, we have uh, this one, which I'm going to open now and see what we get. Another one from this set. What is happening? Why? All right. Adorable. Absolutely adorable. We've got a plastic glass with all our favorite little boys and it looks like they're dancing here. Yeah, they're all uh, doing a jig. Pikachu is really going quick. I should probably christen this glass with some eggnog. All right. That's the end of the nog. All right, more. What do we have today? We have, I think this is a whimsicott fluffy bag garbage thing that I would never buy that I received in the large mystery box. You could put and hide whatever you want in there, kids. Next. I'm gonna peel this one, and we got a Pikachu generic notepad garbage thing. This sucks! That also from the large mystery box. What do we have in this one? Ooh, okay, this is uh, the real Christmas deal. And I got two of them. We've got Pikachu the ghost of Christmas past. Or he's just dressed in white, I don't know. And you can take his ears out. I guess that's a feature if you want. And he also has this little mustache and beard. So that's that. All right, up next, we have another ditto. 
This one seems to be a Grimer or a Muck. Up next, we have uh, a little Pikachu, I mean Mimikyu doll. This one was from a weird doll campaign thing that they had where they made these sort of stitched looking characters called Pokemon Time. I think this is from then. And then we're on to our next one already, which is, oh yes, Santa got me my Pikachu glasses case that I've been asking for. We've got this little thing for wiping the sweat and grease from my glasses. Thanks Pikachu. And then we have a case. A glasses case. I can fold these suckers and I can chuck them in there. All right, now we have a couple more here. And here is, did we open this? It's the Pikachu band campaign, Pokemon Fest uh, band campaign. Look at him with his little guitar. He has um, a black hoodie, which I don't know, can we get him back into that? Now he's styling, he's got his tongue hanging out of his mouth. And we have uh, a keychain hanger, bag hanger, rallet. And now we're going to open up. Ooh, all right, another one in a similar style. Oh, this might be Pokemon time. Yeah, this is one from Pokemon time. Different kind of material, almost leathery. Next, we have Mew. Mew, ditto, ditto Mew. Very cute, very <laughs> pointless. So many things. Another Christmas this year thing. It's got a little bell on. It's Charmander as a, a reindeer. He's got his tail coming out the back of the reindeer outfit. He's a very nice quality plush. He has some little furry bits and little furry details. His hood comes off and on. And that's the end of that. I think I missed out on one of the Christmas plushies, which might have been Sylveon. Oh, here we go. We got the Pikachu counterpart to the Fat Meowth in plushy form. A welcome change. Very, very fat, squishy boy with, again, a very adorable oversized tag. Fat Pikachu for president. Fat Pikachu for president. Two more to go here in my immediate surroundings. Uh, that's a small thing. And then we're going to have a look at our last one, which is another ditto. This time... We've got Wobbuffet, and it, lo it looks like a fish. What is that? All right, I have two more here. I just keep, they just never end. We have in this one, what is this? Ooh, another one of my collectible bottles. I can't stop collecting these things. What is this? Oh, Pikachu band. This one has a whole lot of different groupies or band illustrations. That is very interesting. Well, I'll be sure to put my coffee in there. Shame I don't have any eggnog left. Last of all, a square little one. We've got, that's gonna be some stuff I'm gonna open up. Over there. Let's go. I'll see you there.